Hello. Hello everybody and welcome Hello. along Say to Hello. our baby special. Hello. It is Wednesday Hello. afternoon Hello. and it's three o'clock. So that means Hello. the next 10 to 15 minutes Hello. are all about Hello. our youngest Hello. age group and our babies. Hello. So while we wait for everybody Hello. to come and join us, Hello, let's just sit baby on our lap and go from Hello, side to side. Hello. Let's give those arms a little shake. Hello, Very good. Now let's lift that one arm just as far as it will go. And back down. Let's stretch that other arm now all the way up. And back down. And let's do both of them together. Big stretch. Wave them side to side. skills such as handwriting. So what we are going to do first of all though is we're going to do a little song and our first song today is If You're Happy You Know It. So if we're happy you know it we're going to clap our hands. If we're happy you know it we're going to stamp our feet. If we're happy you know it we swing our arms from side to side and then when we're super happy we're going to do a little dance around. So, Tumble Tots, shall we listen for that music? Let's listen very carefully and get ready to clap our hands. If you're happy and you know to clap your hands. If you're happy and you know to clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Stamp if you're feet. happy and you know it, stamp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. Stamp, stamp. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. Let's see. If you're arms. happy and you know it, swing your arms. Let's go side to side. If you're happy and you know it, swing your arms. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, swing your arms. If you're happy and you know it, dance around. Oh, very good. If you're happy and you know it, dance around. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, dance around. Fly away, Very good. Fly away. 
whenever you are ready. We all know what it's like. So what we're going to do now is we're going to look at our tummy time. Now tummy time is really important for babies. Not many babies like being on their tummy because they don't spend very long on their tummy. And one of the reasons for this is because they're generally put down flat. Now, the reason why they don't like this is because they haven't built up the strength in their arms to push themselves up and to raise their necks. So we would always encourage tummy time to start on a gradient whereby your baby's neck is raised. So you might put them on a series of pillows or sort of your nursing pillows. Those would be absolutely excellent. However, in our classes, we use our barrels. Now, we don't have the barrels here, but what I have is I have one of my tumble top balloon covers. As I said, these come as part of the membership pack for tumble tots. However, you can buy these as well, and they are super strong. Okay, so you can get these on, on our shop, and I think there's a um, 15% discount on these as well at the moment. So these are great for tummy time, but also for some lovely sensory play with babies as well. So I'm just going to pop it there. And the idea being, don't forget, Titi's not a real baby. The idea here is that we want you to place baby down on his tummy or her tummy and just gently rock them back and forth over the um, balloon cover, okay? You need to hold your baby by their torso or sort of by, by their legs and then roll them around like so. Okay, now the idea being that your babies are a bit longer than TT, their arms are probably a little bit longer, but what we're looking to achieve is that as your babies roll, they will start to put their hands down and push off, which shows that they're starting to build their upper body strength and those big gross muscles in their arms. Hopefully as well, they'll do the same with their feet. So as their feet go down, they will push up and start to build those leg muscles as well. Both of those muscle areas are really needed and really important for when babies start to, to crawl, okay? So using your balloon cover, again, they're really strong, guys, so don't worry. And if it's easier, sometimes it's easier to be sort of on your, on your knees when you're doing something like this, so you've got a little bit more control. We can roll babies back and forth, back and forth. What I find is a really good tip in our classes is to always have something in front of your baby for when you're putting them on their tummy. Something for them to engage in that's always going to distract them from their tummy time. So something like one of their rattles or even one of something like their sensory toys. These toys are lovely. Again, we've got these um, sensory toys on our website, 15% off those as well. Okay, so you could put, let me put this one down here instead. So you could put that there pop your baby on their tummy and encourage them to reach for that object. That is going to not only help with their tummy time, but that in itself will then help their cognitive development, so everything going on in their brain, to use both sides of that brain to come together. Ooh, where have you gone? Okay? So that's how we can do it on our balloon covers. As I said, these you can buy from our shop as well. However, what you can also use is one of your bath towels. So all you need to do is we need to make it a little bit thick. So we just roll roll it up to look like one of our bowels. And actually, one of our franchisees um, demonstrated this as well. During, I think it was last week, it was Catherine. So I stole the idea from her. So thanks very much. <laughs> so the same principle applies. You might want to do this maybe on the bed because it's a little bit higher. And all you would do, again, is just roll baby back and forth. Okay, you might need to roll the towel as well as you go, but again, it's just a nice soft surface for babies to roll back and forth and spend that time on their tummy. So we'll pop that there. The guidelines for tummy time say that every baby should spend at least 30 minutes on their tummy every single day. Now, please don't worry if that isn't happening, that is just a guide. And the um, guide does say just to build it up nice and slow, so a couple of minutes here and there, because popping babies on their tummy during their early years is really important, because as I said, it can help with so much of their development. The guidance does say, though, to still don't put your um, babies to sleep on their tummies. And if you want some more of that information, you can find it on the public health website. So 
what we're going to do now for one more exercise to do with tummy surf, to do with tummy time, sorry, is actually just using our legs. Okay, so we use this exercise a lot in our classes, and you basically want to keep your knees bent and place your little tumble tot on your lap. Okay, sorry, on your shins. And your baby will naturally raise raise their head. Again, TT hasn't got a spine. So holding onto their arm, if you sort of let me move back a little bit, forward a little bit. If you lay, go back and raise your legs up and down, up and down. So this exercise is great because it's not only benefiting you, but it's giving your baby a different experience of tummy time. It's making sure you keep good eye contact with your baby, which again, sometimes is why they don't like it because they can't see you. And it's also helping to create that lovely bonding experience. So should we do that again? Don't forget you can do this in your own time. So please don't feel that you need to rush, okay? So pop baby on your shins, lean back, and we're gonna pop our legs up and down, up, and down, up, and down. Well done, everybody. Give yourselves a clap. That was great, wasn't it? So, as I said, there's lots of different ways to try and make tummy time a fun experience for both you and your baby. Now, we've got another song to do, and our song is now Humpty Dumpty. So, shall we put on that music and get ready to join in? Items, sensory items, balloon covers, the streamers, they're all great and suitable to help with your baby's development. But we've got another song to do before we go, and our song is all about those kangaroos that like to hop, our frogs they like to leap in the air, horses like to trot, but we like to fall in a heap. So let's put that music on and listen very carefully. Kangaroos like to hop. Are we ready? And frogs like to leap. Horses like to trot. But I like to fall in a heap. Kangaroos like to hop. And frogs like to leap. Horses like to trot. for you to join in with. We're going to put on our very last song now to finish our session, but thank you for joining me. I've had a lovely time. Head over to tumbletarts.co.uk to go and find lots of baby products and to save 50% at the moment. Off you go guys, have a lovely week and I'll see you very soon. Bye!